First on four, a U.S. House candidate is forced to change his name on the upcoming election ballot. Democrat officials were worried the name he decided to use would confuse voters. CBS Force Nestor Mata joins us in our studios now with the very latest. Nestor? Eddie, it's a name game, and here's the problem. Ruben Ramirez Hinojosa is running for the congressional seat in District 15, which will be left vacant by retiring U.S. Representative Ruben Hinojosa. Ramirez is saying it's not a problem at all, but the Texas Democratic Party is saying drop the Hinojosa. This is 20-year Congressman Ruben Hinojosa of District 15. This is law student and Army veteran Ruben Ramirez Hinojosa. It's easy to see the difference, but could you tell who is who on paper? Well, I wouldn't be able to tell which one is which unless I saw their faces. I wouldn't know if it was him or not. The McAllen native says he initially filed with the Ramirez Hinojosa name, but then got backlash from some worried it would confuse voters. CBS 4 News spoke to Texas Democratic Party Chairman Gilberto Hinojosa, who said in a 2012 congressional run, he used the name Ruben Ramon Ramirez. Are you trying to confuse people? Not at all, not in the least amount. Ramirez said he didn't use the Hinojosa name in his last run to avoid confusion. This time, he says with Hinojosa not on the ballot, he sees nothing wrong. The voters in this district are smart enough. They understand, they can distinguish the two. This is just rhetoric from the other candidates. Critics say Ramirez is trying to pick up loose votes from those thinking Hinojosa is still on the ballot. Chairman Gilberto Hinojosa said they gave Ramirez a chance to sign an affidavit proving he has been using both surnames for the last three years. The chairman says he refused to sign. Did you refuse to swear that you go by both last names? Not at all. I signed it. I dated it in front of that notary public there. He stamped it and he signed off. Ramirez says his IDs do not show the Hinojosa name. You tell me where the name Chewy or Red is on somebody's driver's license. Ramirez even called out U.S. Representative Ruben Hinojosa, saying his staff tried to stop him. When somebody is using a birthright name, he's taking the most action he has in his entire career. Ramirez went on to say several hurdles and unrealistic timetables made by the Texas Democratic Party forced him to stop fighting for his name. He will now run simply as Ruben Ramirez. Ramirez went on to say in his culture it's common to use both your father and mother's surname. He did admit though he thought the Hinojosa Association would make him stand out but never meant to confuse voters. We reached out to Congressman Hinojosa's staff but he was unavailable for comment. Live in the studio, Nestor Mato, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.